Hey guys, what's up? This is Gum, and welcome to Battlefield Hardline on the PC. We are going to be trying to play the game maxed out. You know how Battlefield games tend to be with all their visuals and probably lagging the computer a hell of a lot, but we're going to hope for the best. Now, before we get into this, it should be noted that I don't know what to really expect to Battlefield Hardline. It's not being developed by DICE like, you know, they usually would. Uh, it's being developed by Viscera Games, who were the people behind Dead Space. And I really enjoy the Dead Space series, even if the story sometimes took some not really good notes at all. Uh, but this could possibly be a really good story game. At the very least, it's an interesting premise. It is a cop story, and we don't really get that a lot in games. And so I'm expecting it to be like a cop TV drama thing, and that sounds cool already. So you know what? Let's give them the benefit of the doubt. Let's hope this game is going to be fun, and let's hope it is fairly lengthy. You can already see, well, okay, I guess not in this one, but loading up the game. Uh, from their fucking battle log browser thing. It shows that there were 11 episodes. So hopefully those 11 episodes are actually pretty lengthy uh, each. So we're gonna go ahead and jump into Veteran because the way they word things here, the way Visceral prefers to play Battlefield Hardline, we encourage all experienced players to do the same. Fine. I'll fucking do it. That's the sound of the police. Oh, yes. Okay. <laughs> we're just gonna, we're gonna keep the loading screen in. I like this song. It's funny to me. And at the same time, catchy and enjoyable. Well, at least that first part. Gaze upon this fine country of ours while you can, gentlemen. It's gonna be your last decent view for a long while. Nicholas Mendoza. <laughs> Shit. Guy like you's really gotta fuck up the land here with me. You, uh, might want to secure that weapon, Deputy, before one of these gentlemen takes it off you. I always enjoy seeing dirty cops end up on my bus. It reminds me, the system works. Enjoy the ride, detective. So I'm to assume that I'm Nicholas Mendoza. Three years earlier, wow! This is the one. That's a big jump. Huh, shouldn't take very long. What do you say we bag these guys and go grab some lunch? Uh, yeah, okay. I know a decent Cuban place around the corner. Cuban? Jesus Christ, Nick, you're in vice now. And you're for better than beans and rice. Seriously? Beans and rice. Why don't you let me order for you? Here's an <laughs> idea. I picked the place. Huh? I promise, you'll never go back to eating plantains ever again. You ever had Cuban food? I think you should take the lead this time, all right? Hit with authority, check your corners, find our guy, and we take him down before anyone even thinks about going for their gun. Yeah, I've done this before. Yeah, I haven't. You haven't. All right, let's roll. Use your big boy voice. Oh, oh, okay, we're not just gonna knock the door down? Police! We're coming in! Never mind, Police! here we go! Get to the hands where I can see him! Up where I can see him! Move back and away from the just table! just on the wrong door. Is that a threat, sir? I have a flashlight! Get the light out of my face, yeah? You better watch out. Come on, come these guys. Let's get the hell out of here. Okay, all right. Oh, I was gonna go for this one. He seems like more of a threat than this guy. This one's just words, you know? Okay. Keep those hands on your head and turn around slowly. Slowly. Nice and easy. Oh, you're making a big mistake. We're all friends now. I would really like if we took the weapons before we tried to arrest everybody. Stand there and stare at they spin around. Nothing sudden. It's fucking bullshit. You know it. It's a fucking joke. Two I'll be guys. Out by the morning, cop. You fucking know it. Two guys right next to guns. Oh shit! Oh fuck! That's not what I expected at all. Oh god! It's a lady with a shotgun. Look where that got you. That got out of hand fast. What the fuck was that? You didn't check the door? Hey, I'm the one making arrests. You're supposed to watch the room. Yeah, just check the bodies. 
See if we can figure out what the hell they wrote. Well, I mean, obviously they have it in with dirty people. Oh god, we really fucked up this place. I didn't even shoot that way! <laughs> Bingo. Yeah? What we got? Wallet. ID. Anyone you know? Nope. Dead end. Yeah, there's nobody left to interrogate. Hey, I was tired of burgers, so I got Cuban. Anybody hungry? Hey! Stop right there! Uh -oh. Get after him. Go! Go! I got him! <laughs> You didn't hear the gunshots! You're just making this work! Oh, son of a bitch! Damn, dude, he fucking jumped out a second story window! Please don't make me drive! Oh god, no! Maintain distance, try not to kill him. Head north on Mateo, requesting backup. Listen, man, the last time I drove a car, it was really bad. Intersection clear. Run right into the bus. Okay, no, no, I don't want to run into the bus. Oh, I ran into something else. I should have been in the side passenger seat with a gun, ready to fight it out, you know? Well, at least it's clearing out a path for me. Why do we have to go to the guy who actually has a car that can ca that's capable of getting away from a cop car? For now! Alright, enough. We gotta take this guy down. Uh... Wait, wait till I get closer! Are we gonna shoot him? Or are Stop we gonna ram now. him? Oh! The answer is shoot! Stay where you are! Got you, you son of a bitch! Dude, I'm impressed you're alive at this point. Alright, give me your hands. You have the right to remain silent! Fuck you, man! Oh, you heard this before, huh? <laughs> Okay, that's one way to start off things. This might be a very intriguing game. But it all depends on how they can make these episodes roll out. Guest star, Alexandra. She's a guest star? They're really sticking with the angle of, yeah, this is a TV cop drama. I like it. As long as they don't start every fucking episode off with like an intro or some shit. Episode 1, Back to School. Captain Dawes has never been fond of messy operations, and that last outing was sh a shambles. His men are avoiding him if they can. Not everyone can be so lucky. So, am I gonna get put into like, a tutorial kind of scenario because of the fact that a chick popped out of a bathroom with a shotgun? That's not my fault! Who could have predicted that? Who, who leaves a shotgun inside of a bathroom? <laughs> Just in case everyone gets busted. I guess, I guess them. And look what that got them, they still fucking died. Suspects with warrants. Kent Lawrence. What? Identify and arrest suspects with open warrants to earn rewards. Find evidence to complete case files and unlock special weapons. The hotshot file. Hmm. Five suspects are dead and one remains in custody after a dramatic police raid of an Overtown hotel. This marks the fourth incident of apparent drug violence in Miami this week. We now go live downtown for an exclusive Sky 5 interview with Investigations Captain Julian Dawes. This is an ongoing investigation. So no comment, Captain? This is an ongoing investigation. That is my comment. No comment would be no comment. What the hell is everybody? Oh, drug war, sir. Saw it on TV. It's like the 80s all over again. In fact, I'm gonna wear a white linen suit with the sleeves pushed up. I hope with a pink t-shirt. In the meantime, start to join special detail. Detectives, Mendoza Dow, my office. Yeah. 
You two know each other? Sort of. Good. I'm making you partners. Sit. Mendoza, you recovered several kilos of cocaine today. Congratulations. So tell me, why does coke get stamped? Maker's mark. To prove it came uncut from the source. That's correct. And your coke had a stamp we haven't seen before. Your catch of the day claims you got it from Tyson Latchford, with whom Detective Dow has had several run-ins. I want you two to bring him in for a little chat. Sir, Mendoza's last run in the field, no offense, was a total clusterfuck. Well, fuck you, lady. You're gonna get along great. Dismissed. <laughs> I'm just saying, you gotta look at the context of the situation, not only the results. Were there dead people and a shootout you know, and crashing? Record, I yes. I was following Stoddard's lead in that hotel room. I'm sure you were. But no excuses, detective. It's not an excuse. Just context. See, Nick agrees. Thank you, me. So what's the story with Tyson Lashford? His coke's for the rich and the clueless. Those guys you busted? Tyson's way out of their league. But sometimes he slips freebies to his old hood rat pals. So let's go find one. You're reading my mind, detective. So I'm wondering how the gameplay is gonna play out. So hey, watch yourself tonight. This drug war is no joke. Don't have to tell me. I lost two friends in the last six months. Patrolman. Yeah, I heard about that. I'm sorry. Me too. Miami's gone to shit. Well, that's what we do, right? Clean up the shit. <laughs> Stoddard said that about you. Said what? That you loved being a cop. Hey, hey your was dirty. Let me get that. Don't oh my God. Child. Christ, this hey. guy. Hey. All right, all right, all right, hey, hey. How about, how about, uh, just let me get a, uh, let me get like five dollars. Okay, I know, I know, I know, I know. It's just, um, I'm, I'm what you call a capitalist. <laughs> Sorry, man. Not when I'm on duty. Okay, okay. All right, well, officer, you, 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 uh, take care of the neighborhood. Be safe. All right? All right, homeless guy. Oh, 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 okay. You know, the neighborhood I grew up in isn't too far from here. Really? Rags to riches, huh? Let me guess. You're from South Beach. <laughs> no. No way. L.A., actually. Orange County. Oh. So, riches to rags? <laughs> yeah. Something like that. <laughs> What's this? I'm not gonna Probably a drug sentence, bust. Man. It's probable cause and I'm nuts. I don't need your consent. Hey, Guzman. Who you got there? It's our old pal Hugs. <clears throat> Trunk full of that hot shot shit. Hugs, where's your friend Tap? I don't know where Tap is at. He's looking for Tap. Yeah, you seen him? Nah, but I saw his homie Bricks over with Tap's crew over there on 12th Street. Thanks, Guzman. Appreciate it. Mm. Nice locate, detective. Damn it! Open up! This is my house! I can stop her from texting me! <laughs> so you grew up here, but you weren't born in Miami though, right? Nope. In Havana. Really? How'd you get out? With my mother. She's one tough lady. So what about your dad? Wouldn't know. Haven't seen him in like 20 years. I'm trying to get the fuck away from him. He's still in Cuba? If I had to guess, he's probably dead. Which would be fine by me. Ouch. Sounds like a real gentleman. Oh, he was a real something, all right. Because I didn't have proof of service. I mean, how the hell I'm supposed to have proof of service if I don't know what an asshole we live with? That does seem kind of like a bad part of the system. How can I restrain a person who I don't know where what? lives? Fuck you. Hey, slow down. Okay. Uh, they were a problem, ma'am? Lid doesn't fucking fit. Well, good luck, ma'am. Fuck you! Oof, that's you it? You want me to call for backup, Mendoza? Yeah. CP will probably send in the SWAT team. Oh, joy. Dead ends. Love dead ends. I guess this is where we have to go. 
Come on. We roll up on wheels and we spook the whole neighborhood. Ah, okay. We're getting off a little bit early. This is 13. We're exiting the vehicle. The city blocked off the projects, so there's only one way out. All it does is piss people off. We're gonna do something real quick. Options. Gameplay. Uh, actually, no, audio. Here we go. We have it on war tapes, which makes things sound different. And I noticed that it might have been affecting the quality a little bit. But yeah, I'm interested in, uh... The gameplay, because it says this search warrant thing, which either means that this is one of the guys I have to hunt down for, or maybe he's legitimately a random suspect around the area that I'm going to have to notice and get. But it did make it seem like it was going to be like all open world or something, but no, it's not open world. The guy we're looking for usually slings around here. All right. You're gonna have to show me the way. You're gonna show me the ropes. How do I arrest people? How you doing? You having a good day? Good. So I don't know the whole cop biz. I need to know how to arrest people, pull out my badge, make people respect the authority that I have, you know? And you're gonna be the one to teach me that. Hey, nice thing there. Officer, you wanna spot me? Huh? Yeah, sure, why not? All right, enjoy getting yourself crushed with your what? What? What, what is that? Mmm, ten pounds. You have ten pounds on each side, plus a little bit each. Yeah, you know what? Get that out of here. I can lift more than that. I want to see him get crushed. I want to see him fuck it up. He doesn't want to get spotted. That's okay. So how are you gents doing tonight? Seven. I notice you have a certain property. I don't know if this stuff is legal in California. So I'm just actually just gonna back up. I don't know my way around the law here. I am the law though, so really I could just say probable cause. I assume you know the neighborhood. Nope. Yeah, but I haven't been here in a while. I'll follow your lead. Stuff something in those pants, officer. Thomas, don't make me check your pockets, because I know what I'll find. You sure do. Ruben, <laughs> put a leash on this guy and well, get that in a bag. Actually, I don't I don't really have a bag. <laughs> I don't have a bag. I don't have a brown bag or paper bag or plastic bag. So <laughs> So <laughs> Okay. To the Cops. Yeah, to to the us. Bye, trunk man. Wait, you're not the lady I'm looking for. What's going on with you? Why are you sitting out smoking? Are you stressed out? Something going on in real life? Inside the place? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Wait, what do you mean, mm-hmm? Your house sucks! Ugh. <laughs> it's just a hallway. Who are the bad floor textures? Heads up. There's Prince. Uh oh. Alright. Like well, you have a date These or something, man? Yeah. Man. It's always about time with you, man. Are you arguing about. This is chess, not checkers. Motherfucker, make a move, man. You know what? You made me call one of those guys the. the, the Menstrual. Remember those guys, the Mexican dudes, ball headed, the suit. Oh, the old axe? Yeah, I'm not going to one of those motherfuckers come kick your ass if you don't make a move, man. <laughs> These guys are fighting over chess. I, I'm pull your pants right now. I'm not going to move. You know what I don't believe is that that cop killed him. That was, that was some bullshit. No, that was bullshit. That would never happen in real still, life. still, I'm going to call one of those motherfuckers come kick your ass if you don't make a move right now. You know, I will still kick the fucking ass Ooh. with the fucking crazy ass yeah. axe. Okay, okay, okay. Well, make a move, man. Let's go. Alright, you guys have fun with your chest and your axe, man. I like listening to the people in the world, because it's not like I'll ever run into them again if I just run past them all. You go first. See, this guy knows I'm me. You, oh, this, great. Like we always knew this and boo this. You 
feel me? <laughs> you feel me? <laughs> you don't know. Freeze! Press G to flash your badge to freeze a suspect. Keep your weapon trained on the suspect to, ma to maintain control. If left uncovered, the suspect's alert meter will begin to fill. What I'm talking about. Freeze, freeze, motherfucker! What the hell you want? Miami PD, we got some questions. Yo, detective, who's this? He's my new partner, Bricks. We're here to play bad cop, worse cop. Your friend Tap, where is he? Man, fuck you. I have okay, a taser, bro. Like to worst cop. Nick, take him down. Okay. <laughs> I wanted to tase him. <laughs> tell me what tap is, and we walk away. Well, protect and serve my ass, man. He's on the couch tonight, okay? That's all I needed to hear. Come on, Mendoza. All right, we're gonna leave you on the streets. You can't keep getting away with this shit. I know my rights. What? We're just gonna leave him there? You sure that's smart? No, but I'm sure he tried to kill an undercover last year. Fuck him. Come on, Taps couches in the Arcola projects. He might not be there for long. All right. But what if I want to find what's his name, Lawrence Kent? What if Lawrence that's Kent Taps. is over here? I I'm gonna help you out the lady. To know we're coming. Follow me. Avoid detection. I'm bad at stealth, lady. Uh, what I am good at is making sure people die from bullets. So, we might not be the best partners. Suspect awareness. Suspect awareness is indicated in two ways. An alert meter that fills up as suspects become more dangerous, and vision cones on the minimap, which vary based on your stance. Stay back. Come on, this way. You sure? There's vision cones that way. Oh, I was about to say, lady, that is the wrong place to go according to my senses. Huh, 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 huh. You're not huh. going to tell anyone we're doing this, right, partner? Doing what, detective? Oh. Boy. Okay, come on. You know, we could have just hopped the fence. It's that one was really really short. Oh, we're gonna climb this? Oh, okay, we're gonna open I got it. it. <laughs> Go on through. Thank you kindly. Sorry about that cluster front comment, by the way. Sounds like it was a real mess. But you handled it. Yeah, with lots of bullets. You read on Stoddard anyway. We weren't partners long. Stoddard's a bull. And the world's his china shop. Wow, we are really coming in from a different side. All right, we just circumvented that entire street. Good on us. All right, we're just going to have to go under the assumption that my first suspect, Remember, Warren, is going to be in this place. Anyone sees us, they'll tell him we're coming. We need to keep a low profile. Like what? Toss a shell casing to pull the attention of a criminal in your path and remain undetected. Tossing a shell casing will draw one criminal's attention at a time. The distraction radius of a tossed shell casing is visible on the mini minimap. Neat. All right. I like that it only distracts one person at a time. I hate when it distracts multiple people at a time. Sounded like something fell off the roof. If the air thing breaks, I'm going to stay with my sister. If it breaks, I'll fix it. <laughs> like you fixed the cat? Cat had cancer. And stay with your sisters if I care. Oh, my lord. Distract. Separate. Take down. Tossing a shell casing will draw one criminal's take, uh, attention at a time. Toss a shell take casing to separate groups of criminals. Neat. Okay. Taps just ahead, but there's no way we're getting past these two without taking at least one. What are you talking about? This is the game, man. Yeah. Yeah, I got Nobody this. ever hit the contest like you. Ever, man. Exactly, bro. Easy money. Tell me, Taps is the cheapest motherfucker you ever He go buy you a coat unless there's a turn. That's a fact. What are you thinking? Of? All the shit that's been kicking off. Gunfights and cop killing. You're not kicking in anything without shoes, honey. No shit. No shit. What 
I'm saying is this, baby. If some heavy hitting cartel motherfuckers come pushing up, I ain't pulling out my heat. I'm out. Tap and deal with them himself. Shit, man. <laughs> All right, here we go. Enjoy the distraction. Shut up a second. Something's out there. <laughs> I did not know <laughs> I was gonna smack up my baton like that. And take down. <laughs> Is she still- yeah, she's just still gonna sit down there. Oh wow, these guys have like, gates on their doors. I guess it must be that kind of neighborhood. Cause I've never really seen that before, ever. Uh oh! I barely peeked around the corner! Run because I will chase you. We're looking for Tyson. You her new partner? She do that karate for you yet? I study Krav Maga, karate's mystical bullshit. You are a trip. Tap and Tyson grew up together. White guys who got a taste for the hood. Tap never left. Stand up. Hands on your head. <sighs> hey, Tyson, <sighs> Tap, where is he? A lot of people looking for Tyson. You watch the news, right? Dude's laid low. Life expectancy in the game ain't so good right now. Yeah, we were hoping you could give us some insight into that. Above my pay grade, Fidel. Nick, hook this guy. Thought you'd never ask. <laughs> oh, I swear you cops get off on this shit. Yeah, at first. Then you just get bored. Tap. I am shocked, buddy. Yeah, I got a subscription for that. Oh, God. I know you got warrants. I know you keep your coke around the corner under the dumpster. I know little man who just ran off is probably moving it right now. And seriously, that kid is way too young to be doing this shit. So yeah, we have to take you in for possession. We will. What do you want me to do? <sighs> Interrogate tap. Objective complete. But is that the episode complete? Because I never really got to find the dude with the warrant on him. Or any evidence, for that matter. So... Hopefully we're keeping the ball rolling here.